have so we can get something done. Okay. And just last thing, that was complicated, but your objection to the specifically? Uh, well, um, I feel that um, you know it's going to bog down the family court system. Um, you know, I think that if uh, someone, um, even at that age, 16 or 17, commits a, a violent crime, they need to be held accountable as an adult. Um, you know, they, I feel that uh, they have the common sense at that age to know what's right or wrong. So. Okay, thank you, Carl. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hello, how are you? You're going to be on Facebook before they miss. Oh, at six o'clock. <laughs> I know, you're quick to the trigger. <laughs> So, good to see you. How's so, everything? as you were saying to them, you can say it to me. Absolutely, uh, absolutely. How do you feel about this budget? Well, um, we want to see a budget. That's the thing. Uh, we wish we had more input in the process and the minority. Uh, you know, we wish that our leader was at the table. Uh, and the same thing for the uh, Senate Democrats. We wish that their leader was at the table. We think it would bring a little bit more um, uh, openness and transparency to the process. But, um, you know, we're a little discouraged. We don't have a budget right now, but I'm willing to stay here as long as I have to to get something done, so. You know, I, uh, I said to my other colleagues, I showed them uh, uh, a copy of uh, Empire State Reported. It's a magazine we used to have here in the 80s. Mm -hmm. So back in 1987, the headline was, Hard Time in Albany. And there, there I am in a picture. I look like you with a lot of black hair, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. uh, that was 87. And the governor was Mario Cuomo. Yes. Here we are in 2017, hard time in 2017. You're right, we don't have a budget. I brought enough clothes for two weeks. Mm -hmm. I'm on my third week. Now I'm washing my underwear. That's right. So, <laughs> I hope we get a budget too, I but know. the question is, in, I, in, in all the arguments I hear, uh, is this, are we headed to a shutdown or are we headed towards a modern day shakedown? Yeah, that's a good question. That's a good question because, you know, I tell you, well, luckily we're not going to have a shutdown because we just passed that extender, but, 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 you know, it's kind of a shakedown too, you know, I mean, you know, the, the governor wants his uh, certain priorities. Uh, you know, the majorities want theirs, so they're clashing right now, and uh, we'll see how who comes out on top. But, um, you know, unfortunately, like I said, I wish we had more of a seat at the table, give our input a little bit more, but that's just been the way it's been for decades here, unfortunately. So until we get that changed, you know, I don't think anything will change there. But I think we got to work together, Republicans, Democrats, we got to work together, and we got to try to get something done for the people here. So. Yeah, so another day, and I, I sound like you're ready to rumble. Absolutely. So I'm going to follow you into the chat. Come on in. Let's go. <laughs> Let's, go. Let's have fun at least, right? <laughs> That's right. <laughs>